The overall goal of the following experiment is to isolate purified muscle cells from human patient muscle biopsies and immortalize them for downstream studies. This is achieved by first weighing, mincing, and digesting the collected tissue to dissociate the mononuclear cells. As a second step, the myogenic cells are purified from non-myogenic cells by fax. Next, myogenic cells are infected with both CDK4 and HTERT to generate immortalized cells. The results show that patient-derived living muscle cells can be expanded for several passages and differentiated based on cell fusion assays, the presence of twitching myotubes, and the expression of myogenic markers. The implications of this technique extend beyond diagnosis of muscle disease because it can potentially provide unlimited number of myogenic cells for drug screening or other downstream applications where high number of cells are required. I will be demonstrating the procedure along with Jerome Robin, a postdoctoral fellow from the laboratory of Dr. Woody Wright in Dallas. Begin with dissociating the muscle biopsy to purify the myogenic cells. First, in a tissue culture biosafety hood, record the mass of the muscle biopsy. Next, in a 10 centimeter dish, use sterile scalpels to mince the tissue into finely chopped pieces. Add a few drops of 1x HBSS so the tissue does not dry out. Per gram